Hi, I'm Sean Etchen, and I'm the Flexographic Instructor here at Dunwoody College of Technology. Today, we're going to be talking about press setup. Now, we're going to talk about inking up a print station on the Mark Andy 2200. Before you ink up a station, you need to make sure you have the proper analog roll selected. I've already gone through and selected the proper analog rolls for what we're printing today. You want to pull the cartridge out. Make sure the analog roll is properly fitted into the, the cartridge and tighten the metering roll to the analog roll until there is a thin line of light between the analog roll and the metering roll. Also, make sure that the gears are meshed between the analog roll and the metering roll. Now carefully push the, ink, the print station back into the press. Check to make sure the feet are lined up. Press it towards the rewind and lock the print station into place by throwing the print station lock switch to the up position. Now, turn the analog roll motor on. The analog roll motor will start to turn and adjust the metering roll to the analog roll position to achieve an orange peel. We want a nice even orange peel across the analog roll. just like that. Now we're going to install the doctor blade. Use a little bit of oil and lubricate the cams on the side of the doctor blade. Now at this point I want to talk about safety. Doctor blades are extremely sharp. Do not cut yourself with them. Take the doctor blade, install it into the doctor blade holders. Notice that the bolts are facing towards the rewind. The bolts are towards the rewind. Once it's seated into the doctor blade holder, turn the screws to tighten it down into place. You need to have minimal and even doctor blade pressure. So bring it down just until it starts to remove the ink and back up until the ink is on the analog roll and bring it down one last time. And then tap across the top of the doctor blade, tap, 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 and do a quarter of a turn to assure that it's nice and tight on the analog roll. Now we're going to install a print cylinder into the Mark Andy 2200. Before we install the print cylinder, it is imperative that we turn the analog roll off. Do that by flipping the analog roll motor to the off position. Take the plate roll, insert it into the press, and roll it into the proper location. Now, adjust the blocks here with, to the proper location for the plate cylinder that you're using. Refer to your Mark Andy manual for the proper hole locations. Once those are in the proper location, grab the plate roll pin, lubricate the tip, insert it, push it in, rotate it to the right until the plate roll pin pops up into the keyway, and pull your print cylinder to the operator side until it locks in place. Now we're going to mesh the gears back up on the ink knobs until the plate freely spins. Then lightly spin it and bring it down until your gears are meshed. Then do a half a turn. Turn your analog roll motor back on. Now we're ready to turn on the lamps and start to print. 